down or just whatever you're comfortable with. How you doing, Mario? Good, how are you? This is a high risk, high reward fight for you. You know, what's the best thing for the deal? Guys, Rocco Mario is 26 victories, no defeats, 17 knockouts. He is the defending undefeated WBA Super. I mean, like I said, I mean, this is a, I mean, see a huge opportunity overall. I mean, I'm very excited. I mean, this is a, a very winnable fight for me, you know, regardless of what everybody is saying. And um, I mean, I'm just excited, you know, to be back back in the ring, you know, to be here in Atlanta. And, uh, it's a great opportunity. You think people underestimate your size? You're a true 140, you know, they underestimate your size? I think so. Um, I think it's not going to be until people see us both in the ring, you know, uh, when we come find that, that they're going to really realize, you know, the how much size I have, you know, for, for 140. Mario, do you feel uh, almost, uh, you said that kind of almost, you, you feel almost disrespected that people kind of counted you out when, when he's the guy coming up to weight classes. You're the champion. Yeah, yeah, no, I mean, you know, somehow, you know, he's still the favorite, you know, even though, I mean, he is the, the challenger in this fight. But, um, you know, I mean, I, I just take it as a, as motivation. Right. Mario, what advantage do you have going on Saturday night over Tank Davis, although he's coming up to weight classes? Uh, I mean, height-wise, you know, just uh, reach, uh, you know, those, those are the major advantages. But, um, you know, like I said, I mean, I'm just as dangerous as he is. You know, I'm just as explosive, just as fast, and um, I'll, I'll be able to show they come find out. When the opportunity came around, when they called you, hey, you want to take Davis on the face, what did you say? Oh man, I was like, I was like, let's let's do it. I was like, but I was like, I'm not going down on 135. And then that's when they were like, nah, you, you gotta come up. And I was like, yeah, man, even better. You've been on this undercard before, so what have you seen? You know that you can take it to this fight on this undercard, not giving what you see. You've seen the fight before. Yeah, no, no, I've, I've seen the fight plenty of times. You know, like I said, he's a, he's a great fighter. He's very, uh, he's been very successful in the, the lower weight divisions with uh, smaller opponents. But um, you know, this is uh, this is a different fight for him as well. Do you feel that being his last fight, he was against a tall, long guy like yourself, but obviously, you know, 130 pounds in Leo Santa Cruz, and, and he had some issues there until he, he got Leo out of there. I feel like, did that give you any, uh, I don't know, confidence and strategy, kind of seeing that and kind of maybe, you know, taking something from Leo Santa Cruz's performance again? Uh, I didn't take too much away from the Santa Cruz fight. I mean, uh, I feel he fought Santa Cruz, you know, the way he did because he didn't respect Santa Cruz's power. But, uh, you know, um, you know, with our fight, you know, he, he didn't have to know the choice. But, I mean, he's not going to fight me the same way he fought Santa Cruz. And uh, whatever he, he, he does come fight, I mean, I'm, I'm going to have to adapt. Do you feel that look at all the credit you deserve, being that he is moving up to weight classes and all this stuff? I mean, I feel like, like you said, he's favored to win, so you better get Right? Yeah, no, I mean, I should, but I mean, as a, as a boxing fan, it's pretty good. Mario, a lot of talk has been about the size difference. Do you get the sense that maybe aside from your size, your skills are being I think that's that's definitely one thing that uh, that hasn't been highlighted just as much, you know, as, as my size. You know, I'm just as skillful. Uh, I've been boxing just, just as long as he has, and uh, you know, I, I have excellent boxing IQ as well. Whenever I step in the ring. What about him? Do you feel? Um, I don't know. It's, it's maybe the biggest thing to look out for for him. Uh, I'm just knowing, you know, at any time, you know, maybe Javante, you know, from round one to round 12, you know, he's a dangerous fighter. You know, it only takes one punch, you know, to change the fight. And uh, he definitely has that, that, that one punch. Last question. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I'll, I'll find that out, come find that. But I mean, we we prepared, you know, as, as if he is. Cool. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Mario. Thank you, Mario. Thank you, Mario. Thank you, Mario.
six feet. 